So welcome to another Java programming tutorial and in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to actually physically get the, the length of a string so we can see how many characters are inside that string. So let's say we have a string and we're just going to call it something as usual and set it equal to just hello oh. or hello world actually. So we come, and that's just highlighted uh, yellow in our clips, and that is just because it's unused. But don't worry about that for now. Then what we can do is system dot out dot print ln, then in brackets, so we come, we can do the string is, and then and um. We do something dot length, and then you have to do brackets because this could take arguments, but we're not right now. And then and characters long. Okay, so what this will do is it will basically tell you the string is, and then a space after that, and then it will give you the length. So so it will be something like I don't know ten characters or something. Um, so that will display the length there, and then followed by characters long, just to complete the sentence. So let's just run this, and the string is 12 characters long, and so basically it's just counted every character in here, including the space, and then and including the exclamation mark as well, and told you it's 12 characters long. So where can we use this? Well, let's say you're creating an application where you can register so you register like a password for it and it will tell you whether it's too short too long no it wouldn't be too long but it will tell you whether it's too short and whether it's going to be hacked easily so let's say let's rename this string to password and we're just going to put this as I don't know just password 1 2 3 4 so let's say the person's password is password1234. Now that's got a fairly good amount of uh, characters inside it. But obviously it's a common password but we're not going to go into that today. We're just going to be looking at the amount of characters in it and seeing whether it's strong based on that. So we're going to do if and then in brackets semicolon not semicolon sorry uh, curly brackets. We're going, to do, we're going to do if password dot length uh, double brackets is less than or equal to no sorry not equal to basically if it's less than 8 then we're just going to do system dot out dot print ln your password is too short must be more than Eight characters. It actually has to be eight or more, but I'm, I can't bother to write that in. You get the idea. Okay, so if it's less than eight, then we're going to display this. But if it's not, if it's not less than eight and it's secure, so basically, if it's more, if it's eight or more, what we're going to do is display this but saying it's perfect so let's just copy this because we're lazy and just write your password is a good length now if we save that and this is just when I was just testing earlier so just ignore that your password is a good length but now if we just make this thing like pass and we run your password is too short, must be more than 8 characters. It has to be 8 or more, but you, you get the idea. So, thanks for watching this tutorial. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. And I will see you in the next tutorial.